welcome back to my channel. In case you're new, my name is Kim, and I usually do what's for dinner videos every Friday. That's probably my most popular video, but I do like to throw in some other type of videos, um, grocery hauls, cleaning videos, and just life videos. So anyways, today's video was filmed over probably about a three day span. I was sent a desk from a company called, if I say it right, Aquasi. Uh, uh, yeah, Aquasi. <laughs> they sent me a desk, and so I put that together, and I realized it was too big for my living room. So, I took my small desk from my bedroom, and I moved it to my living room, and then I took the big desk and put it in my room. So, my husband is going to use that big desk, and I'm going to use my little desk, but I had kind of a predicament there, is um, I wanted it to look nicer because it's in my living room, and you see it when you come in, so I didn't want it just covered in things or even the way I had it decorated in my room I wasn't too worried so I had a lot of things out on my desk so in this video there's a little bit of cleaning and then I have some DIYs of how I tried to make the desk a little better it's not a hundred percent where I want it to be but I do like it and I'm also going to show you the desk in my bedroom that my husband's going to end up using right now we have his father's computer on it and we have our printer on it and it's not exactly the way we want it but I just thought this would be a fun video to bring y'all along and just kind of spend a few days with me working on this project so anyways thank y'all so much for watching and if you're new to my channel uh, and if you like videos like this please hit the subscribe button and also turn the post notifications on so you'll always be notified when I upload a new video so anyways let's get started hey y'all I am going to share with y'all a desk that was sent to me. It's by the company Accuzy. I guess that's how you say it. Anyways, this is, I believe, the 55 inch. I'll let you know for sure. Um, it's packaged like this here, and I'm fixing to open it up and show y'all what it comes with and how easy it is to put together. Okay, y'all. Um, I'm going to do some voiceovers over this part here. I'm just going to kind of run through and show you how this desk, um, how easy it was to put together. The only part I had, I had a little trouble with one part, y'all. Um, only because I was one person trying to hold all the pieces and I don't have a lot of upper body strength. But anyways, um, I'm just unpacking everything and uh, yeah, that's what's going on right now. The stories I've been told. They never seem to leave my mind Ooh, On this road that I am on I gotta stay here for some time Okay y'all, I wanted to show you how everything is clearly labeled um, Very clearly labeled So it should be very easy to put together um, here and then we have the instruction which I mean this looks so simple and easy we have all of the, the bolts and everything else and even the tool so we're going to start putting this together okay here I am with the legs putting on I guess this is kind of like the brace part down here at the bottom and it came with I think you call that an allen wrench but it came with one and it was really easy to do this um, if I can do it anybody can but I'm just kind of running through showing y'all how easy it was to put together and yeah so we'll get past this part in just a little bit I thought I would leave this in. This is a real life moment. This is the part I was having trouble with trying to attach the legs to, I guess you would call that the top part, the frame for the top of the desk. That does not work very 
good. So. <laughs> okay, y'all. I'm not the best at this, so I'm gonna put y'all down. In the video, but I finally had a prop that top brace part or whatever up onto my coffee table and then I was able to kind of pull it together and <laughs> attach it. This part would have been nice to have had a second person, but it's doable. It's doable by yourself if you don't have someone with you. And then this, from this part on, it, everything went together very easily. Um, just bolted everything together. And yeah, this was a very simple desk to put together. And even though it's not extremely heavy, it does hold a lot of weight and it is very sturdy. Back, all the way back to them days Running around in a gown and a crown Barefoot Okay, I'm not going to put these on yet because I'm going to kind of wait and see. Um, but there's this, what they, they call this a... Let's give you the exact name of what it is. They call this a file pack, and so you can put it on either end. You can put it on this end here, or on the other end. There's two holes, and you will use um, these these little screws that fit into each other. Screw them into that spot there, and then there are also these little hooks right here, or not hooks. These little, yeah, they call these just hooks. Um, you can put those on either end of the desk to hang things on um, like this you can see right here sorry y'all let me get on a better angle actually let me take it so we could we could put the same and then we have this little hook here and there's one other thing there is this thing here that is, I'm not sure. Let's see. I may have to look on the description. Because I'm really not sure. Okay, y'all. I looked on Amazon because I could not remember. These are called cable management sleeves. Um, I was hoping to find something on here that kind of showed how they could be used. Um, but I don't really see anything. These will zip together like so. Maybe I can do it. And you can put your, maybe if I can do it. They zip together like so. Your cords would go in here, and then you can um, um, I guess you could I guess you could clip this with your cords. I don't know. But anyways, it come with four of those also. So I will show you all a little closer look at the desk. Okay, y'all, this is a work in progress. <laughs> right now I have lots of random things stuck under there. This is from Courtney's bed because <gasps> We took it off and I need to put it in the shop. This is my um, father-in-law who passed away. It's his computer, so my husband got it. This is our printer. And my husband's gonna do something in this little area, so this is gonna be his desk. And then I have a lot of random stuff down here that I need to go through that I haven't got around to. But um, this desk is very sturdy, and it's, like I said, it's 55 inches long. So it's a good size desk and I mean it's supposed to hold a lot of weight I forget the exact rating on it so you can put a lot of stuff on it you don't have to worry about it <laughs> falling down or something but anyways there it is all right y'all now we're on day two I have pulled out my vacuum and I'm just kind of doing some vacuuming in here before we continue on with the desk it's been raining and we don't have a lot of concrete outside in our yard. We just have grass and dirt and gravel. And so when it rains, we have a mess. Even though there is a rug, it's like we always are tracking in dirt and grass. So I'm trying to get a little bit of cleaning done um, to the floor before we move on and get everything fixed up.
okay, we decided that that desk was too big for our living room. So my husband is going to take that desk um, and we're going to put it in the bedroom, our bedroom. Well, I'm moving it in there, but I mean, he's going to take over that desk. It's going to be his desk. And so here I am in our bedroom um, taking everything off of my desk and I'm going to move my desk into the living room. And his desk, the big desk I just got, is going to go into this corner of our room. My room isn't like really decorated up. I mean, I have decorations. I try to make it look nice, but I'm not so much worried about how it looks um, as I am the living room. So you're going to be seeing me unloading things and moving things. And I may pop on here every now and then to kind of talk to y'all. Uh oh, look at me go, trying to show off my muscles. Not really, this is just a particle board <laughs> desk, so it's not very heavy. And I would like to get a nicer desk, especially since it's in the living room. But hey, I bought this from our neighbor for I think $20. So I thought that wasn't too bad. And here I am still trying to clean up all that grass because even with my little um, cordless vacuum, it does not get all the grass that is stuck to this black rug. I do not like this black rug. I don't know why I bought a black rug, but I am going to replace that because everything shows like right away on it. I don't know what I was thinking, but anyways, I'm going to clean this spot up and get that desk set up over here. And y'all, I'm using my Method Wood for Good cleaner on this desk. Even though it's not real wood, I still use that on it. It smells like almonds. It is so, like it's so good. And I get it from Grove Collaborative, in case you're wondering what Gro Grove <laughs> Collaborative is. Um, it's like a service where you can order um, products off of there, cleaning products, and they ship them to your house. So if you're ever interested in ordering from Grove, I have a link down in the description box. And this kind of threw me off right here, y'all, because I did not want the desk right next to my door because it's kind of a close, a close area right there. And I was afraid everybody would come in and run right into the desk. It kind of bothers me that the desk is kind of over the window, but I think this is going to work out in the long run a lot better than having it right up against the front door. So yeah, I'm kind of rambling. this point I'm realizing that I had way too much stuff on this desk in the first place and I'm like you know what I need to <laughs> to condense it down um, so that there's not so much up on top of here because you know when people walk into our living room I don't want them to see everything that's all over my desk so at first I was gonna keep this little thing it's like a little cardboard thing I got it um, Hobby Lobby and it's really cute and all but I think having it here in my living room it's just not going to work. So I'm just kind of going through stuff and just trying to figure out how I'm going to do everything. And you'll see as the video goes on that a lot of this stuff is not going to be on top of the desk. I do not have my desk chair right now. My husband um, took it to his deer stand because you can adjust the desk chair up and down and so and it was more comfortable and so he has it out there but this weekend he's going to go and get it and then I'll have my regular desk chair here in the living room and have y'all seen the cute chairs that they have at Hobby Lobby they're kind of like a blush pink in the spring collection they are so cute but mm -mm, I can't pay that price even with 40% off <laughs> Oh, 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 
I pull into your driveway into Now I'm going to set up that big desk here in the corner of my room and uh, yeah my husband's going to use it and eventually we will have like some storage underneath there to store things because it is a pretty big desk and it is high up so right now the way it looks it's not going to stay that way but um, for the time being it is just going to be this way let go like there's no tomorrow let's have a drink just relax all your problems will fade if you're ready for a good time count on me there's a party in the backyard dance your problems away i'm all about the good vibes i know you're all about the good vibes do you know how much i love you want to see you smile where's the happy girl that i know with the battery died but anyways Hey y'all, I'm sorry about the lighting. I'm trying to get a good spot. I'm actually sitting in the floor in my living room. Y'all saw earlier in the video, this video is kind of spanning over several days, but you saw that I moved my desk, which I will flip around here and show you again. Y'all saw that I moved my desk in here into the living room. And what I'm dealing with is, I don't like how this looks. It's all open. So I bought one of these bins yesterday at Walmart thinking, oh, I'll put it in there. This is 10 inches, this is 10 and a half, and you, it's stiff, it will not mold much. But I had bought these little cardboard magazine holder things, so I bought some more. These were from Dollar Tree. Sorry, let me get my stuff. Okay, so I went to Dollar Tree and I bought two more of these. All they have is these wild colors. So I had the idea that I would take some contact paper it's got this white with black flowers. I thought it would kind of blend with the desk. And we're going to try to recover these and use it to put some of this stuff in so that it'll look a little better. This one right here, I'm, I'm gonna, I got this at Dollar Tree also. They didn't have any more. And for now, I may just have to use the brown one unless I find something else that will work in this spot because it's not, it's not as deep as this one. So I can't do another of that. But I'm trying to kind of make this look a little better now that it's going to be in the living room and um sorry <laughs> and i want to start using my desk more plus my husband is starting his own business and so i'm going to be in charge of look at that y'all laundry laundry real life um i'm going to be in charge of doing all of the paperwork and stuff and so i need to have a, a good system and i want to start just doing my videos there. i usually do them on the couch which is no big deal i can still move it but that way i can actually get to things easier too it's right here and i think i'm more likely to sit here and do it I can watch TV too. <laughs> um, so anyways, I just thought I would kind of bring y'all along and we'll see what we can do with this desk. Sorry, my phone rang and I put this one together and forgot to show y'all. But these are so easy to put together. I mean, you just like fold it out like that. And you just do like this, this, and that. And then boom. I'm almost, these almost look different than my other one. Okay, never mind. They are the same. I thought it was different. But I guess, anyways. So, my, what I'm going to attempt to do is take this and put it on. So, I'll let y'all watch and see. On this first one, I was kind of cutting it um, in pieces like I did one half and then I did the other half but on the other ones I actually just took the whole roll wrapped it all the way around kind of trimmed it cut it and I don't know it seemed like it worked easier that way to me and I wasn't really planning on using this anywhere else it was only a dollar a roll and I actually used two rolls and I had a little bit left other than the scrap pieces but I ended up throwing those away because I don't think I'll use them anywhere else not 
good at cutting. I don't know, I've never been good. Even when I was a kid, it was like. And this project was a very cheap, inexpensive project. So each of those little magazine things, a dollar a piece, two rolls of the contact paper, and it really transformed these little containers and it made the desk look so much better. You can kind of see right here, the pattern doesn't kind of go, but I mean, it's pretty close. This is gonna be the only part showing, so. Oh, this is the only part that's gonna be showing, so I think it'll be good. So, I'm gonna continue on, and I may end up doing something, I don't know, to the bottom. I'll let y'all know. Because it for some reason right here, it just doesn't wanna stick down, which maybe once, they, once everything's in it, it will. So, move on to the, more, to the next Okay, y'all, I got them done. Um. Some of the, two of them, I ended up coming around on the bottom with it, and then I put another piece over here to kind of hold it down. This was the very first one I did, so I did a little, because it looked like it was gonna come up. And then this one I covered completely. But anyways, um, there they are like this, and then there they are. You can slightly see the design coming through. I don't know. I don't know if I should, I might end up, thinking about maybe putting another piece over this. I don't know. Because yeah, now that I look at it, you can see it. Let okay. me see y'all. I went ahead and put another layer on it. Um, since this side is gonna be in there and only people that, or person, that's gonna see this is me, so. But I wanted the outside, that is how I'm gonna have it under there. I wanted it to be, um, so if you see anything, you're just seeing the picture underneath it now, not the design of the box or whatever. So I'm gonna get everything kind of situated and we're gonna put it right in here. And I need to clean all this trash up. Okay, y'all, there are the magazine holders or file holders, whatever you wanna call them, all done. And they fit perfect. They're really snug, but they fit in there perfectly. Now this section above it is what I need to work on next. I need to find something that will fit in that spot that will match better. Um, I want it to be big enough to hold like, you know, paper and some spiral notebooks and things like that. So I'm not happy with that, but it'll do for now. And then on top, I didn't want it to be so cluttered because um, it's right here in the living room and ignore that box, I need to throw it away. But I found this lamp at Dollar General and I think it is so cute. It was $16, it came with the shade because I was looking at some at Walmart but you had to buy the lamp and you had to buy the shade and it was gonna be even more. And then my friend Yonina gave this, it's actually, this is actually a Christmas ornament. She gave it to me two years ago for Christmas and, or two Christmas, yeah, that'd be two years ago. Anyways, <laughs> almost two years ago. It was a person for us. Y'all just ignore me, I get crazy. But um, I love that and it makes me think of YouTube and stuff. So I keep it out all year round on my desk. And then I have this little plant thingy. I got that little glass thing from the spring collection at Hobby Lobby a few years ago. And then I also bought the little greenery there too. I got this little, it's actually a vase that I got at Dollar Tree to hold some pins and things. And then this little, Cup holder um, thingy coaster that's the word I got this at dollar uh, dollar general for a dollar and then of course I have my computer right now my computer chair is not in here and I have something I'm gonna get to kind of or at least push those cords so you won't see it but you won't see it as much once I get my computer chair back in here but there is how with the Sun coming in the window it kind of messes with it but there is my desk, y'all. I think it looks so much better than before. It's not the desk that I hope, I mean, I hope to end up with something a little nicer in the future, but for now, I think it kind of goes with our living room. Yeah, ignore all that real life. But yeah, 